Why, Torley, you're looking awfully misshapen today, huh? It could happen to you too, Nevedez. Here's how to get your default avatar back, like the look when you first started Second Life. If your customizing appearances have not turned out how you expected, just head over to the My Inventory tab at the sidebar, click that, Look here at the bottom, the library right here. Click to expand. It contains, you can't change the contents of it. it contains content from Linden Lab, like stock content we provide, including the default avatars. If you open the clothing folder and right here, there's a bunch and there's some newer ones right here in initial outfits. And then what you can do is you may notice if you right click, you can't wear it grayed out that could be easier to use so the workaround is to click and hold and then drag it onto your avatar until the cursor changes like that then release the mouse button as you normally might if you're familiar with this method of wearing an avatar and then watch as you change like that what also happens is a copy of this folder is made inside the clothing folder as you can see we're wearing all this and so if you want to save this for a while, it's always good to go to my appearance and you can save as a new outfit if you want. It's up to you. Also, if that method doesn't do it for you, there is a more advanced, well, advanced in the sense that it's under the hood and unsupported method. You'll need to open this advanced menu if you don't have it, it's control alt D on Windows, or just go to wiki.secondlife.com and search for advanced menu, and then show develop menu from here, and then go deeper here, and under avatar, character tests, you can either test me a male or test female, and this will revert you to one of the default forms, like so. So that's how you revert your avatar to a default of at any time you're like i screwed up and you want a fresh start have a delightful second life